happy to be happy. I'm black and I'm proud that I have been chosen to wear the conscious cloud, and I'm fine. Peace, y'all. Welcome back to my channel. So I gotta let y'all know these earrings is from Eccentric Bow Boutique. Do not touch my hair, honey, and these lashes too. So make sure. You get the link below and go check it out. I got hair wrap, lashes, and statement earrings for sure. Because we are a walking statement, honey. So yeah, let me stop playing with y'all. So this video is about star locks. A lot of people want to know, like, how do I star locks? What do I use to star locks? I want to star locks. You know, I'm here. I got you. I got you. So first things first. First things first is be prepared for a long journey. This journey will not be easy. It will be stressful, frustrating. It has a lot of benefits, but it definitely will not be easy. So you definitely need patience. You definitely need a lock tissue or somebody who is knowledgeable. If you wanna, you know, start your own, I, you know, I tip, I tip my hat to you because I was not with it. I'm not about that high life. Like, I don't know nothing about it. I'm getting more better now because you, I'll be playing in my hair now that it's done. But definitely before, honey, I don't even know how to break. Now, in the black community, you know that's a problem. Maybe like, you, no, I don't want I can plait. <laughs> I can plait for you. I can grease your scalp. I can put some bow reds on something but that's it so yeah you definitely need patience you definitely need a good person in your hair who has your hair hair's best interest if it's not you make sure she know make sure she got knowledge make sure she know what she doing make sure you've seen pictures of people who hair she did before your hair don't let her experiment on your hair you can experiment on your own you definitely need to make sure that um you don't use a lot of just going in the store, picking up random products, because sis, you ain't gonna need them. You don't need them. You will only need two or three, maybe your whole journey. You know, don't be a product junkie. Start just picking up any and everything, because it say lock and twist and this and this and that. Find you one staple and rock with it. A lot of different products have a lot of different things in it. And sometimes they don't agree with our hair. Make sure you know what you're putting in your hair. Um, that helps that helps make sure your body is ready your mind is ready my locks were a spiritual journey i have been wearing braids for like four years so i was like why not you know just get it done it's happening and i'm transitioning i'm going you know back to where i belong so this is what helped me make sure you are ready for the journey though like i cannot stress this enough people get locks and they just think it's your hair gonna lock overnight it takes about six months a normal hair make sure you don't have chemicals in your hair i recommend cutting all the chemical out your hair or wait until your hair grow out because that took my journey far too long it was just a long 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 drawn out process because my hair was processed so i initially was upset because four months my hair was looking like it did when i had started you know that's like a waste of money and then that stylist was telling me to come a lot and i was spending money so i was very irritated but that's why i went through that so i could tell you guys this be completely natural um you may have to start your you know locks off with gel but don't continue to use it after your hair is locked because i just feel like the buildup and the itching and everything whatever is in like black gel to make your hair itch and the flakes and everything but definitely in the beginning you might gotta just suck her up and use it just because you want your hair to stay manicured and you want to try to lock so yeah definitely takes about six months to lock Definitely don't want to have no processed hair. Uh, processed hair will not lock. It will not twist. It will not. It's not natural. So if you have relaxed hair or chemicals in your hair, you definitely will know the difference. And you might be upset. 
because you're going to be like me. Like, dang, where my hair ain't looking? Since I did it for four months and nothing happened. That's why I always credit my journey to being in May because that's when I cut all the dead, all the um, hair off and started fresh. And I'm coming up on my four year anniversary, May 22nd. And I'm so excited. But I never used relaxers with this journey. I did. I haven't had a relaxer maybe since high school, I want to say. But I will say that I dye my hair. And you guys know I love to dye and bleach my hair. And I cannot stress this enough. Those are chemicals as well. So, um those you know they changed my hair you know they messed up my hair so my hair was not locking at a speed at a rate i didn't see no improvement i don't know nothing about hair but i know my hair wasn't supposed to look like that so <laughs> i just cut it i just cut it all off and started from the beginning i dyed my hair now i bleach it now of course once a year but i make sure i moisturize it and oil it down 365 i make sure my hair is oiled to the t because i know you know bleaching and dyeing is is damaging just as well as some other stuff so make sure you're ready for that but you definitely need to have a a natural head when you start so patience loctician um natural hair patient I'm telling you, you're going to need patience because it's going to be days you're going to look in that mirror and your hair going to be ugly and you're going to feel ugly and you're going to think you're ugly and somebody going to tell you you're ugly. I'm telling you, sis, you ain't ugly and your hair just takes time. So you need patience and you need to go all in. That's what you need. Those are my tips for starting locks. So make sure if you're ready, make sure you, like, you know, you're going to go through they not want to retwist stage. I mean, they're not going to want to twist stage they're not going to want a lock stage they're not like they may start budding they may look stringy but i'm telling you all those things are going to make great locks just be patient expect the unexpected don't have no expectation and i am tisha sharif thank you for watching see you next time make sure you shop a citric glow boutique because i have all your dope afrocentric accessories on hand now and ready to ship see you in my next video